Or what I do is I run down the other end. I ring the doorbell. He gets really mad because he hears it. Hates doorbells. He decides the door's at fault and smashes the door. What do you reckon? You think someone's behind the door and he's going to ring the... <laughs> he thinks so. <laughs> he thinks the gas man's there. The Mormons have turned up. I wonder if my friend over there will respond to it. We don't want any! We're going to kick the door in! We've been kids. It's the fourth time this week. Smash it! Yeah, you give it a good kick in, mate. You show them. Now do we kill him? Uh. Oh, we did it. Okay, I think we're going to have to do it again. <laughs> Look how nice I am, Turngate. It's a false test. You made it that way. Stop trying to teach me a lesson. Stupid nonsense. Stop you and your silly test, Turngate. I'm going to destroy you at the end. We're going to get a choice, aren't we? You get the choice to destroy it or not. In which case, I'm pulling the flush. I feel so present, so aware. Oh, I feel as if I'm part of something bigger. It's to everything and everyone. In other words, we're now a monster. Hi. I'm a monster now. It was like part of me died. Oh no, there's some bad man killing the... Bad man is killing... He's killing my, my friends. The nasty humankind is mankind is, is killing us. How horrible. What's this? I have been in the air, haven't I? It feels like I was just running, trying to get away. Oh no! That poor guy set up the trap. Saving my life. I better be up for the task ahead so that guy didn't risk his life in vain. Is that supposed to be us? He burned to death because of that. I'm alive. Is this actually on or not? There we go. Couldn't get there for a second. What does this do? Okay. Oh no! I died! What does that mean? Game. Oh, I have won. My number is infinite. Through this, I see the needs of the many outweigh the life of just one. What? Did I do it right or did I do it wrong? Do I have to do it again? What this Spock nonsense? I am... And always will be your friend. Have a look in stone door. I'll not be able to open it using brute strength. Oh. Pressure switch. Hello. I need someone to help me. I should make fun of Rutherford Car anyway, it's one of my favourite films. So we're going to do it again, are we? But we need to... Because it's not quite the same as last time. But we, this time we need to have Chum. Chum? Is there a Chum? What's this? Makes the doors open. Corresponds to which one it does it. I need to think like the turn gate. You muppet! Did I ask you to go running out like that? Did I ask you to do that? This is it's all it's trial trial it's trial and error. Oh, I, I know. I don't like trial and error. I just better work things out from the start. This, the we get the idea, Turngate. So I don't push the okay, so I've got to open the first one, I think. Maybe I don't. 
Right, let's see what door that... Before we open the door, let's see what door that opens. This is number one. Okay. Number one opens number one. Where's the fire trap? <laughs> what is going on? Why does that happen? So that whenever we get to here, that plonker always runs over there. Can we skip this turn gate? Right, so if we go too far, somebody decides to do a runner and gets killed. Correct? So what happens if... We've got to open this door then. There's nowhere else to go. I'm going to open this damn door. But I don't know what this other, this other one here does. Well, the only thing we can do is stand on the switch. Like a door closed not far from here. It opened again. If I take this off of here, this door's going to close. So I've got to do this. So maybe I, I stand on this one and then I pull the switch. Yeah? Maybe? Can I not reach the boat to do things? Guesswork here, guys. Guesswork. Move! Get it through the damn hole! Right. So now that switch is now... Whatever's, whatever the guy's running out from should now be... Close. If I do this, I'm figuring that we won't hear the idiot running and killing himself. Apparently not. This one's closed. So I guess I've got to sacrifice myself, I think, is the answer. Ready? And now we're back here again. Because someone locked us in. Now we can get out. Ah, game! Here's the poor dead person here. That's me. I know, we get the idea, game. We sacrifice to the other we can live. In some way, I'm that other man now. There's no clear distinction between myself and another person. Yeah, that's how the turn gate thinks. I'm not quite sure if he's testing us or trying to show us what he is. Or show us, show it what it is. But if we do this, we're going to die? Is that true? Is that what happened last time? Because there are only so many of us? Because this switch always kills us. Correct. didn't kill us. And what's this? Plants. Yay! Bad de detailed plants. <laughs> Getting sick of your nonsense, turn gate. <sighs> if you like. Oh God! And what killed him? Yes. What? Reveal all, Turngate. Tell me your secrets. Maybe you should have helped then. 
If we work together so much. Back in this room again, that's where the chemical thingy was, wasn't it? Maybe. I'm not getting the same sort of feeling as I would with something like the original Half-Life where, you know, obviously we were kicking off the trouble in the first place. You are, you are nasty turn gay as well. You don't, you don't purely um, react to our attack. You've been, you've been far worse than is necessary. But you, mankind, yeah. you are different. You have proved this. And now I ask for your mercy. Do not allow me to be destroyed by your kin, which they would surely do. They followed the Inuit here, and you followed them. There will be more. Will you send word? Will you destroy all trace of this place, so that no mankind will ever discover me again? Will you do this for me? Interesting. So... Um, I admit, Tungay, you have been building, dealing with a bunch of scumbags, a bunch of jerks who, you know, believe in caste systems and everything else and all the rubbish around that. Doesn't mean, doesn't mean that the right people wouldn't deal with you properly. Think how many things you could, we, you know, the old cheesy line about how much we could learn, to, how much we could do, how much we could learn together by doing this, how much we could work together with the right people, you know, and, oh, I don't so the idea is the choice is do we kill him or not? Should we good be good, I guess? Should we be good and destroy the place? I presume burying us with it is there the answer. Uh There are things I need Oh, it's what it says at the start. Things you may not understand. This is the this is the, this is the, this is the typing that happens at the very, very start of the game. I'm not sure what to do, I must think, think, think. I need to think. I need to get out of here. So we sent a message. Who do we send the message to, though? Because... What does it all mean? I'm having a bit of a session, I think. It won't budge. What is going on? I thought that message was the one being sent to us from Howard, our dad. Are oh, we here? We appear to be um, losing the plot slowly. Anything in here? We finally need the batteries to see? How are we seeing the place off? That doesn't really help. Uh. Not sure to do us think, think, think. I don't really want you don't want, know what you want me to do, game. Have I got anything useful in my pack, maybe? Painkillers, gas masks, glow stick. Oh, I think we'll probably miss one of these. Looks like I'm miss maybe I'm missing one. Saw my own head off. What am I supposed to do, game? Give me a clue. Hang myself from the bars. Throw things on the floor. I don't know what you want me to do, game. There's not much to interact with in here, is there, really? Having a bit of a session. Well, we can kill ourselves with painkillers. What about that? What do you reckon? Didn't really help very much. Nothing's around. We can't use the keyboard. I must think, think. What year is it? Where am I? What did that do? The, the circle is getting smaller. 
<laughs> what is going on? Will you do this for me? It asked, and I said that I would. So no choice then. I promised the Hive that I would contact someone I could trust. And that I would have them destroy all evidence of this place, just as my father had promised himself. I, however, will not make the same mistakes my father made. You now understand the truth of the events, events, events that led me here, and the immeasurable importance of my words. Um, this knowledge you must have the strength through that which I could not. The turning gate was quite correct. We humans are a dangerous, headless herd. Wrong spelling. But intelligent, intelligent individuals, there was this faculty, facility, sought to reveal and control the turn gate. And the turn gate turned to me for salvation. The hive ran its tests on me, and I jumped through its hoops like the monkey it took me for. But I am no monkey. The turn gate was right. I am entirely unlike it. I have more income with Clarence. I promised I would send this email to you. I promised to ask that you keep all humans from this place. Who is this going to, by the way? For the sake of the turn gate and for the human race. I lied. Oh, Phil, you bad man. If we are lucky, then by the time you read this, I will be dead. If fate frowns, we all perish. The Northwestern Mine is located at reference. Beebody beebody bobbid bob. Kill them. Kill them all! Message sent. Who did you send it to? Who to? Prime Minister? The new kit? I don't know what's going on. I don't know what happened. Save artifacts used. Nine oh, I missed one lot of notes and one collectible. Well, bum holes. I don't think you get very much for getting the last collectible. Maybe. I, I don't recall. Um, do you remember all the way back there's a there's a game uh, on one of the computers. There's a thing called Shmup. I think you get a password for that by getting all the players. I'm not that interested enough to go back and do it. I, I quite enjoyed big chunks of this game. Clarence was wonderful. Clarence was fabulous. It was. It's not a very horror game, really. I know parts of it are a little horrible to look at, but it's not really a horror game. And there's not a lot of tension. Unlike what was promised at the very start of the game, with the spooky noises and someone being killed, there wasn't really a lot of horror. A bit of puzzling, not too much. The story, though, it's a bit cheesy. It's a bit cheesy sci-fi, sci-fi horror. And it didn't make a lot of sense towards the end. <laughs> I don't know what's going on. There is one more part to it. There is, is it Overture, the last one? Or did I play Overture before? There's one more piece, though. So I might play that soon. But... I don't know. I d <laughs> if you know what went on and what it means, write to me. But I doubt you'll be able to make much sense. <laughs> and whatever happens, obviously there's a third game, so. But, I, you know, I, I, um, I guess whatever they're trying to do to destroy the turn gate, it didn't work. Ugh, blimey. Right then. Thanks for watching, anyway. I hope you enjoyed it despite the, the weirdness towards the end. And uh, if you did, I hope you join me again next time.